Is evolution evidence evaporating? Were you taught that the theory of evolution is supported heavily by science? Is it possible that this theory has been disproved and we just don't know about it yet? I was a teacher for years before I discovered that the theory of evolution was not as scientific as I thought. Now that was quite shocking to say the least. Over the last few years I have discovered numerous flaws in the theory. My question is, why weren't we told? These are just a few of the secrets that I have discovered over the last few years. Now, if you are like me, you will have to dig beneath the surface of the typical textbooks and nature shows and that type of thing. So that you can begin discovering the dozens of so-called facts that have been proven wrong, most of them decades ago. Are you aware that the fossil record does not support the theory of evolution? No intermediate fossils had, have ever been verified to support the theory. Now without these uh, in-between fossils being discovered, even Darwin himself admitted that this theory, that his theory would be no good. Also the mutations, which are supposedly the vehicle of evolution, are heading in the wrong direction. Mutations are only harmful never positive or permanently good. Uh, mutations are basically genetic accidents. Well this is exactly the opposite of what evolution requires. And the third thing is that no life can begin without life. This is a scientific law called the law of biogenesis that has never been disproved. Again evolution requires just the opposite. Now these three things are the basically the three uh, main legs that support evolution and of course now they have been completely removed. Without these three you uh, absolutely have no possibility for evolution to be true. It is absolutely stunning to realize that there are literally dozens of these examples that show the theory is impossible. But why have these secrets been hidden from us? Why weren't we told these things in our schools and universities? It is up to each one of us to discover for ourselves the truth about this theory. Where can we go to find out all these contradictions? And is it true that since the theory contradicts science so much that, uh, that we can categorize it as a philosophy or a religion? And would this mean that our children are actually being taught a state religion? Well, that's an interesting question. There is no question that the evidence supporting evolution has evaporated because of the scientific discoveries in the last few decades. So for more information, go to evosecrets.com and learn more about the contradictions between evolution and science.